Your Natchez History Minute is brought to you by Natchez National Historical Park. Born near Natchez in 1841, Wilson Brown escaped slavery and joined the U.S. Navy. He served on the USS Harford, the flagship of Admiral David Farragut's blockading squadron, which kept supplies from being reaching the South. On August 5, 1864, during the Battle of Mobile Bay, Wilson was working on the Hartford's birth deck when the Confederate shell exploded. He was blown through the hatch and landed unconscious on the deck below. The body of another man landed on top of him. Upon regaining consciousness, Brown promptly returned to the birth deck and jealously continued to perform his duties. Although four of the six men in the station had been either killed or wounded by enemy fire, for his actions, Brown was awarded the nation's highest military decoration, the Medal of Honor, on December 31, 1864. Wilson Brown died on this day, January 24, 1900, and is buried in the Natchez National Cemetery. My name is Clarence A. Chapman, and this is the Natchez National Cemetery, and this has been your Natchez History Minute.